Well, good evening, everybody. Hi, little girl. You like your eggs a saucer? That used to be your brother's when he was a baby. You like it? And look, there's Barrel. What's up, dude? What'd you get today? Pumpkin Man. Pumpkin Man? I got Goosey. You got a Pumpkin Man? Yeah. So Lauren went out since all the Halloween stuff's discounted and got Christopher a pumpkin man. She had no idea how big it was when she bought it. Here he is. Our house isn't tall enough to even have him, but Christopher loves him. You love him? Oh, you love him so much you're hitting him. That's wonderful. Good stuff. All right, eat your dinner. We're trying to get things ready before our babysitter Booker comes. Oh, this is like ominous, like. He's right behind me, isn't he? Uh. Well, babysitter has arrived. Yeah, yeah. What do you think of that pumpkin guy? It's great. It's great? Yep. He does light up. He does light up, Christopher's telling you all about. What else do you want to tell us about him? See, like the father figure you always wanted? He does light up. He shows up. Yeah. Well, okay. All right, well, we are out of the house. How you feeling? Ready to be out of the house. <laughs> We got little girl with us. How was today? Um, she did take good naps, but I don't know if she's getting teeth because she is just fussy all the time. And you Even said she's fed and rested. And you said you noticed that she's actually a real picky eater, unlike Beryl was at her yeah, age. Three out of the four foods we've tried, she goes <laughs> and spits it out. Oh no. We are going to a restaurant called Zoop. It's a soup place. I don't know why they call themselves Zoop. I, I don't get like why that was their choice. But it's pretty good. I haven't had it for years. We went to one years ago, but never went back. And they have sandwiches and other stuff, but soup is their thing. And I'm a real big soup person. You could say I'm a super man, right? Right? All right, catch you later. All right, what'd you get? Lobster biscuit with red bull. I remember. Oh, I really that's a wanted, big bowl. I really wanted soup when I was pregnant, but I wanted the lobster bisque. I was nervous because I'm so weird about shellfish or whatever seafood when I'm pregnant. Why do you always talk about when you were pregnant? Those days are done. Because that's when I craved soup. Oh. I said that in the beginning. Cool. All right, my turn. Just kidding. I like to mess with him. Do you like when I mess with you? No. Okay, cool. Good talk. I got. A uh, cup of soup and a salad that is way bigger. This is like a side salad and it's huge and it looks amazing. There you go, kids. Ooh, bread, multi grain. I wanted one of those, but I'm glad I didn't get that. That'd be bad for me. So I'm gonna slam this and we're gonna have some fun. Did you have fun with your friends, Christopher? Yeah. What'd you guys do? Choo choo. Who's this creep? Oh. Looks like you really watched the kids. Oh, you almost tripped on your daughter. Good awareness. Do you like the Batman, Sam? <laughs> uh, in this room, we have a five-year-old, a two-year-old, and a one-year-old. But he's going to be three in like two weeks. I like watching Rio. Oh, classic. What's your take on Rio? Not the city, the movie. It's good. It's good? It's good enough. Sam, what are your thoughts? Tell Dr. Corm something. <laughs> well, Christopher, did you have fun? I think I already asked. Yes. Choo choo. You're crashing into my leg. <laughs> oh, that's my phone, actually. Yeah, I played way more than I did. <laughs> yeah. I like the Batman stuff, too, guys. Who's your favorite Batman character, John? Uh, Batman. Ah, uh, that's an easy one. Yeah, that's obvious. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Maybe we could ask your viewers who they think the true protagonist is in the original Jurassic Park. All right, all right, all right. So, all right, this is this is real easy to do with Christopher doing this right now to my face. Yeah. Real easy. Thanks for making it easy, Beryl. So, Booker and I had a debate about who the true protagonist is. Now, he didn't even say true. He said who the protagonist... 
who's the main protagonist in Jurassic Park. Now, you probably understand where he's coming from if you saw my other vlog where he said his favorite superhero. But tell us in the comments who you think the main protagonist in Jurassic Park is. I think it's obvious. Cool. You think it's obvious? <laughs> yeah, yeah, good one. Hey, cool. What? Do you know where this goes? That goes on Clayface's hand, the big guy. Clayface. Yeah, it's a villain from Batman. You don't remember Clayface? I've never seen Batman. You ever watched the animated show as a kid? No. What did you watch as a kid? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> did you have a childhood? No. <laughs> Christopher, do we have to keep doing this? I'm only five. <laughs> so Lauren had her monthly like mom's hangout night that she's going to right now. And Jared's coming over. We're going to watch the World Series. I think I'm rooting for the Astros. Yeah, Astros. We'll see that. I used to actually play baseball back in the day. Not like professionally, I know you thought that. But just up through middle school. I didn't want to do any high school sports. Ooh, the blue from the screen. Ooh. But I didn't want to do any, whoops, ran in the lamp. Body awareness, Lauren, if you're watching, you're right. I have no body awareness. Back to what I was originally saying. I never really wanted to play any high school sports or do any extracurriculars until my dad started asking me, hey, you should probably think about doing this. And then I did trivia, and I did, which was fun, but it wasn't that much commitment, so that was great. And then I did some plays, and I really enjoyed that. And that's why I'm such a character. I'm crushing it today. Hey, buddy, you want to see what uh, Christopher got today? Yeah. All right, it's pretty cool. Lauren was really excited to get it, but she didn't know how big it was, so this is sweet. Ooh, it's raining hard. You just hold this right here, and let's see how it looks coming up. It arises. Yes. And it falls over. It needs a little assistance. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Wow. Christopher loves it. He's afraid of clowns, but loves this creepy guy. It was it was like I think it was like 20 bucks. And it's originally like 80. So. Hey. Good job. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Alright, Jared, who do you want to win? Astros for sure. Me too. That's how I felt as well. I wasn't like totally confident, but now I feel good that they're ahead because I'm a bandwagon. Why do you want the Astros? I hate the Dodgers. He's a Cubs fan. I'm an Indians fan. Neither one of our teams got to go again this year, which is sad. Just sad. Well, guys, when your next morning, someone woke up. I fell asleep. I figured the Astros would win, and they did. They were up 5 nothing when I went to bed. I forgot how long baseball games can be sometimes. But did you have a good night? Yeah? You gonna be good today? I don't know, I think that's a no. Wednesdays are like really hard to vlog, um, especially when Lauren goes out, because she's my main star on Wednesday nights at State Night. But I hope you enjoyed this vlog, no matter how long it is. And I hope you look forward to the weekends with us. This Saturday, Lauren's actually taking a little girl on a little day trip, so it'll just be me and Beryl. But one day I'll take you by myself. Does it sound fun? Yeah? Oh. Uh, speechless. Literally, because she doesn't know what words are. Sorry the light's still blinding behind us, but we will see you next time in whatever, dude.